Hello friends, I'm back with my channel Q Analysis. Please subscribe for more videos on quality analysis and testing. Feel free to share my videos. So today we are going to talk about lean methodologies, lean process and we'll see what exactly lean means. Lean is equal to let's eliminate a non-value add. What does lean mean? Okay, this is a question which most of the people who don't know about lean would be asking when they hear about lean for the first time in IT or software development. Lean was a concept, it was introduced by Toyota in 1950s to address the inventory management with an ultimate goal of reducing the process time and improving the quality. Lean is a systematic method of waste minimization within a production system without sacrificing productivity. That's what we are looking for. In most of the IT organization, this is what we look for. Now let's move on to the lean principles. There are five basic lean principles which you have to follow in order to get lean. They are specifying the value, what the customer needs, and then mapping the value to the stream, what all value and a non-value add, which you have in your system, you have to figure it out. Establishing a pull system wherein product and services information can be pulled from end to end. Implementing the pull. The pull should be in such a way that the minimum, uh, with minimum effort, maximum utilization should be seen and working to the perfection. All these things, all these five uh, concepts are implemented with waste management which includes waste like defects, overproduction, waiting, non-utilization of resources, transportation, inventory, motion, and excessive processing. We'll talk about it in our upcoming slides, maybe in future slides. Now I know what exactly is the meaning of lean, but why to go lean? This is a question which most of you would be asking. So let's move on to our next slide to figure out why to go lean. Okay, I'll give you five reasons for why to go lean. It is not always helpful to build more products than you can use, you can test, or to produce more when you cannot sell them. Lean is not based upon the principle of doing things right first time. It is based on continuous cycle of learning and improvement. Lean relies upon the notions of eliminating waste, delivering fast-paced builds, building quality in, respecting people, and setting up best standards. Lean principle of manufacturing and product development methods are equally applicable to software development and IT. Lean community is far more mature than any other uh, system, any other production lines because they know how to keep all the changes in balance. And we don't have to forget they are in market since 1950s now. When we know what is lean and why to go lean, let's move on to our next slide which talks about how to get lean. Lean is something which cannot be done halfway. It's a mindset. It cannot be done halfway. Okay. So you have to think for getting lean, you have to have a mindset. The second point is you need to create a value stream mapping. That is, to develop a visual picture of all those processes which are to be used from a start till finish. The third point is 5S system which includes sorting, setting, shining, standardizing and sustaining the complete process and product. I'll explain them in my upcoming video. React immediately to any change and solve the problems one by one. And the last one is flow, pull, reduce work in progress and continuously improve. These are the main steps, five main steps through which you can get lean. I'll come up with the next video in which I'll explain how to utilize the lean methodology in testing or maybe in development and how can you practically implement all these steps in order to get lean. Please feel free to comment, share and like my video and subscribe to my channel and I'll come up with my video very soon. Thank you.